Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Cole Karski with Beef Outdoors. I got my buddy Travis and the canoe out here today. And we're gonna do a little river fishing with a little more familiar body of water to us. And the target is some smallmouth and some walleye mixed in. So let's see if we can put together a little fun morning here, doing a little quick trip and gonna get after it. First pitch, I'm starting with a beaver tail leech, and I think Travis had a net rig on. So we'll see what we can pick up. Travis is on with a smallmouth. Small, smallmouth. little guy little cigar <laughs> it's quite good Better one. Nice. That. Yep. This is going to be the Travis took me fishing, and I should probably put on a Ned rig. I don't. Oh. Yep. There you go. Looks like a good one.
get on that rock you snag for me. Yep. Yeah, I think so. We're probably about the same size. Maybe it is a little better. Oh yeah. Come on. There we go. Trying to be all Bassmaster like and get the lip. From the other side now? Yeah. Probably not come back probably not coming back this way so might as well fish it till it's completely till it's dry. This feels like a better one. The double up. Yeah, that feels. That looks like a good one. Oh, yeah. That's on the bigger end. Of yeah. The size out here. Man, they're strong. Yep. That's a good one right there, Travis. Probably two and a quarter. Yeah. Lots of spunk. I think you found something with that glow jig. Man, it's a fat one. Spitting up bugs and stuff. Yeah, mine mine spit up a few things too as it was coming up to the surface. That might be a pretty cool picture with the... Awesome with the sun oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah so this is what I caught my fish on today indie jigs uh net head now travis makes these jigs he pours them he paints them and basically any color you want he's got a glow one there some brown yeah and... so this is pretty much the same as owner blockhead it's got the owner 5313 in it, which is the best hook in my opinion. Um, but the difference is I can do any color and this has a glow on it, which I think I caught the biggest fish today on that. You did. And then I got some matte brown crawfish colors, which is really good for clear water. I got Z-Man TRDs on there, but I can pretty much do any color. So I'm sure Cole will link me up. Yep, in the... for sure I'll throw his Instagram in the link. I, I got other jigs on there too, so check it out. Yeah, lots of cool stuff, lots of unique stuff. He does lots of different colors, different patterns and sizes. You can, you think it up, he can probably do it. So, awesome. Be 
beaver tail leech did it. Thank God. I didn't want to deal with that. <laughs> I did. Still a little small to keep, but he's a walleye. And you got a small mouth? Yeah, a little small mouth. Nice little double up. Got around it. One size. Yep. Nice one, Travis. Choked. Oh, almost got me. Oh, that wouldn't have been good. 
Guess not. There we go. <laughs> Make it easier to do that. <laughs> That's a keeper. There's another good one. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. I'm gonna fish that leech as a moving bait. Okay, they'll probably sound better. Yeah. I'm gonna give this a little whirl and then... Try a little bit. Well, if you pull this, it just, the, the tail flicks just out of natural, so... Can't cast it as far. Ah, nice. Does it work? Yep. Oh, guys got some spunk. I mean, you pull leeches on like spinners for walleyes, so yeah. it's kind of the same principle. All right, Nick. That looks like a good one. Just, and the, the whole being in a canoe thing.
jerk bait. Spawn. If I can double up real quick here. Two species. Doubled up. <laughs> Your sounds better than mine. Oh, mine's all mine's all funky now. Oh, there he got out of it. Come on. Yours is bigger, definitely. <laughs> it's about the third double of the day, though. Yeah. It's uh, hard to beat that. If they no. were four pounders, that'd be awesome. Oh my god. In a tournament, box fish. Is that poured by the company? Uh, yeah, Reaction Innovation. Well, I think so. Yeah, there's the keeper. Seems like the walleye just goes straight to you. Get away from me, bug. Feels like another walleye. You're right. Fish tacos are on the menu for Tuesday. It's official. A fish taco Tuesday. Yeah, the smallie. Instant. A little better? No. Just just Same a lot old. of gusto. Yeah. I think I got a walleye. You're on a walleye, man. Yeah, you do.
That's a great eater right there. Little beaver tail. Perfect eater walleye. Okay, you're about to get splashed. Okay, let's see what you want to do here. Let swim, swim down the river, I guess. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen eventually. I'm on my last piece of beaver tail. Oh, really? Just because I'm donating jigs left and right. Fish it a little more aggressively, and I've gotten walleye bites. Huh. Come on, let it go, bud. Oh! <laughs> Oop, I did not intend to do that. Kind of casting at a funky angle. That was an interception. Yeah. <laughs> We, uh, we were out here for a couple hours, and did we put the smack down on the fish. I know you're not going to see all of them because there was, I don't know, 75 smallmouth and a few dozen, or a few, probably about a dozen walleyes. We got a few keepers for some, for some meals. But yeah, heck of a lot of fun. Always good to get out in the canoe, see some beautiful scenery, hang out with a buddy, rip some lips, so. This is Cole Karski with Beef Outdoors. Tight lines, everyone.